I have spent probably the last 10 years trying to figure out how do I describe myself in a way that people can understand, but it also captures the breadth of what I do. And this has been a tussle. It's funny because it's what I do for other people. And it's the thing that I struggle with the most. Who am I and what do I need to be prioritizing? And this year was the first time I made the conscious effort to be on where I was in a point in the day and a point in the week. And I need to be intentional. I need to be as present with my kids as I am with my clients. Yeah. I think so many of us can relate to that. Like I, for myself, like Maya is going to be three in a month and I catch myself when I'm with her, like on my phone for a second or Slack messaging or my team or something like that. And at first I was like, no big deal. But I'm like, no, wait, she's picking up on all these things. She's seeing this that, hey, daddy's on the phone when he's with me. Am I less important than his phone? I'm still working on that. I've experienced the same thing where I work from home, literally just two minutes. I don't know if everybody heard it, but she just got home from preschool. My wife just picked her up and, you know, she knows that daddy's quote unquote working. I wanted to show her what's possible in doing what makes you happy and being able to do that in the way of still making money 